Hey guys, really quick video today on my FPV setup for my UAV slash drone that I'm building. I don't like using the term drone, but hey, it seems to be all the rage right now. This is the electronics that's going to go into my EPP FPV uh, aircraft. Basically, we've got a fly sky transmitter and receiver combo. These things are bottom of the barrel cheap and they work. Worth every penny guys. Awesome radio. The receiver for that is here and there's a bunch of other stuff here so let's take a quick look at it. What I've got in the main heart of this is the Cyclops Tornado OSD and Autopilot. This will do my autopilot as well as give me all the on-screen display functions I'll show you shortly. Uh, this is the GPS antenna that's an input to it. Basically it's severed in half. This side is being fed from our main battery that feeds our motors. I've just got a 2200 hooked up through the current sensor here, which is actually feeding power to this side as well. But you can feed it from a separate battery, but that measures current and voltage, outputs the camera output to the transmitter, 5.8 gigahertz in this case. We've just got a dipole set up and it's input is the CCD camera up here. As well, we have a pan and tilt hooked up so we can do our tilt and our pan and we can look around while we're flying. Should be pretty cool, should be pretty handy and it's sending it all down and on this side we have a basic button control for setting up our OSD before we take off. Um, normally this side was fed from your ESC but I've just got a UBEC hooked up here with a little LiPo just for the sake of bench testing. As well, I have a multi-camera switcher so I can do up to three cameras and one channel from the receiver I can do switching between the cameras. So you just hook this in line between your cameras and your OSD and you're all set. And you can switch around, look around, different views. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to prototype this without the camera switcher and we're going to get it up flying and get it usable and make sure all our radio equipment is okay and we can just have a quick look at the osd portion now basically this is the receiver from the 5.8 this is my dvr which is recording everything to an sd card in case i should need it should we uh hopefully not crash but if we do we can get the gps coordinates off the screen so this is just for other people to view. I'm using my fat chart goggles and let's have a quick look at what we have on the display. I threw the lens cap on real quick and we're getting a little reflections in here because we're in the workshop but on the left hand side you can see our main pack voltage as well if we chose to do a separate pack for the AV you would see it there. Our current consumption in amps and our total consumption in milliamp hours. We're not running a motor right now. Along the bottom you'll be able to see your compass and on the right you can see your airspeed uh, as well as uh, GPS and all the other good stuff that we need to see. And we also have an artificial horizon. I'll just tilt and you can see we can move around. That's me tilting the module so we can tell what attitude and uh, what role we have on the aircraft. But that's about it. So that in a nutshell is my FPV setup that's going in my aircraft. Hopefully we can get this thing up flying soon. I can show you some flight video. Uh, we will have some other cameras for outside view and hope you enjoy guys. If you like these kind of videos please consider a thumbs up and a subscribe down below. It really helps the channel guys. Good luck in all your projects.